New at 6, a measure that would allow Missouri schools to accept students from outside their district has taken a step forward in the legislature. Open enrollment was approved by House members. Joe McLean has why rural schools are concerned about how it could affect their future. This vote was less Republican versus Democrat and more rural versus urban. It passed 86 to 73, with 27 Republicans voting no on open enrollment, mainly the ones from the state's rural areas. And opponents say schools in those areas are the ones under threat with this policy. I ask the, the body to have faith in their local districts. This puts the decision of the local taxpayers on how their district may look in the future. Missouri House lawmakers approved a framework for schools to accept students from outside their public school district. Sedalia Republican Brad Pollitt is the sponsor. This keeps all the public school students that are presently in public schools in the public school system. Pollitt and other advocates of open enrollment say it's meant to allow families to flee struggling or failing schools and seek a better option elsewhere. In doing so, Pollitt says, it puts pressure on the struggling schools to perform better. But opponents of the idea say the state should instead focus on improving the struggling schools instead of threatening them with closure. Open enrollment will leave small school rural districts fighting for their lives against larger rural districts that have more resources and it will lead to district consolidation. Democrats say the state needs to update its formula for how to fund schools to more efficiently and accurately send money to where it's needed most. House Minority Leader Crystal Quaid, who's running for governor, filed a bill to do that. What my bill proposes is that instead of focusing on actual attendance of our students, we make an easy switch to funding based on enrollment within our schools. This will seriously help our uh, rural communities as well as schools who have kids with high needs. Missouri has historically ranked near the bottom for state funding for public education and the minimum salary for teachers by law is just $25,000. Open enrollment will now be sent to the Senate and if passed to Governor Parson. In Jefferson City, Joe McLean, KY3 News.